Now, Storm Team 2 meteorologist Cameron Saliga with the Miami Valley Certified Most Accurate Forecast. Another hot and humid one here through the Miami Valley, and we did even have some of those showers, even in a few rumble thunder, rumbles of thunder through the Miami Valley as well. But right now on the Goodwill Auto Auction camera, downtown Dayton, you see those cumulus clouds. It's very humid outside and hot today, getting into the 90s. But uh, right now we are seeing just a little bit of a breeze there. You can see some of those trees moving as well as the camera shaking. Highs today in the 90s for a lot of us actually. Some areas not quite getting to that mark with uh, 88 there into Springfield. But uh, Dayton 93, Wapkaneta and Bell Fountain at 90 and 92 down in Springboro. Over the next 12 hours here, we'll see those temperatures drop into the uh, lower 70s. So wake up tomorrow right around 71 degrees. But the good news is those dew points are only going to be in those upper 60s and uh, even lower 70s just for one or so more days here as uh, we go into the middle middle of the week. Now going into your Wednesday, we'll see those temperatures here right around uh, 85, 86 degrees, maybe getting up to 87 here into Dayton and going through your day tomorrow. We'll have those temperatures through the daytime uh, quite in uh, quite cooler uh, in the morning hours, right around 75 by 9 a.m. But going through the day, we could see a chance of some showers on and off through the daytime starting off right around 7 a.m. or so. We'll have a, a line of some showers that will make its way through, but it will be weakening as it does. So uh, as we go into the morning hours, for that work commute. Just make sure that you have that umbrella handy and we could see chances of thunderstorms into the afternoon. Those highs getting up in the mid 80s and just one more day of seeing those uh, very humid conditions. Live Doppler 2 HD. We're actually seeing that storm that I mentioned at the beginning of the show. It's starting to wind on down. It was weakening when it uh, was moving just south of Salina. Now it is right there. Uh, by Grand Lake St. Mary's actually, and that is weakening. So here in the Miami Valley, for the most part, staying dry in the afternoon, but we do have a system that's going to push on through and actually bring us relief from the heat and humidity that uh, will go into your evening tomorrow that will start to move on through. Here in Ohio, though, for the most part, seeing lots of sunshine into uh, the Buckeye State. 90 degrees currently there in Troy, Dayton 93, 90 in Wapkaneta, but 86 in Versailles and Bell Fountain, so not everyone quite getting to that 90 degree mark and uh, still in the 80s. Dew points, 61 in Versailles, 68 Bell Fountain, 66 in the Dayton, but some 70s as well. We see 70 into Springfield and 70 over there in Eaton. Future track here, not going to be expecting uh, widespread shower thunderstorm activity going into the evening. We'll see a little bit more cloud cover going through the nighttime than what we have right now. And then there into the morning hours, there is that chance for showers, maybe even a rumble of thunder, but uh, not expecting any anything severe. And then another round will start to form going through the afternoon so we could see another uh, round there in the afternoon but the evening goes on we'll start to see that clear on out into the overnight hours and we'll start off cloudy into your Thursday morning maybe a chance of a shower in the morning hours but uh, as that system does depart we should dry on out for the weekend dew points going through your Wednesday in the upper 60s even 70 degrees in some areas but that cold front pushes on through we'll see those uh, dew points down into the 60s and eventually to the 50s going into your Friday. Those temperatures will be in the 70s uh, into the weekend. 71 is your low tonight. Early shower or storm then 87 degrees tomorrow with showers, thunderstorms and winds up to 15 miles per hour. Over the next seven days, temperatures dropping down to those 70s there into your Friday and look the last as we go into the work week next week, starting off the week 80 degrees, but uh, staying mainly in those 70s. Brooke.